Good morning. This is Dr. Tarek. Today my topic is medical terminology 2. I actually I am repeating these lectures. Word root and their meaning. A medical term usually consists of three parts. Prefix, word root and suffix. They come in this sequence that I that's why I have written in this sequence word root before prefix prefix come before the word root and suffix come after the sub, uh, word root suffix is that part of the medical terminology which comes after the word root to modify the meaning and it gives us information about four things P C, D, D. Procedure, condition, disease, and disorder. These four things. Suffix gives us information about these four things. Procedure, condition, disease and disorder. This come after the word root to modify the meaning. Now first I am going to start with the suffixes which meaning pertaining to, related to or pertaining to. They are il, al, sorry, al, ak, ac, as, ous. Nary, N-A-R-Y, and E-L, E-A-L. For example, the word is cardiac. Dermal. So, cardia means related to heart. Cardiac. Related to heart. Dermal. Derm is skin, so related to skin. Related to skin. Subcutaneous. Subcutaneous. As mean pertaining to, sub mean under, cutane mean skin. So pertaining to under the skin. Sub mean under. Cutane mean skin, us mean pertaining to, pertaining to under the skin, pertaining to under the skin, cardiac pertaining to heart, dermal pertaining to skin. Next word is pulmonary. Airy pertaining to pulmon, lung. So pertaining to lung, this is airy, a r y, pulmonary. Pulmon mean lung, airy mean pertaining to, pertaining to lung. Pharyngeal, 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 e l. E A L to pharynx, so pertaining to throat. So I have used all the suffixes which meaning pertaining to cardiac, pertaining to heart, dermal, pertaining to skin, subcutaneous, pertaining to under the skin, pulmonary, pertaining to lung, and pharyngeal, pertaining to throat. Similarly, we can say laryngeal pertaining to vice box. So these were the suffixes which are used for pertaining to, uh, which, are, which mean pertaining to.
Now, next I'm going to tell you suffixes which mean pathology. Path means skin uh, disease and logy means study of. Pathology means study of disease. So these words which are used as suffixes, they have the meaning of diseases. Suffixes meaning diseases. Now I am going to use it. Number one is algae. Algae is a suffix. It, its meaning is pain. Number two is dynia. Its meaning the same, pain. So these are two suffixes which have meaning of pain. And the word root is gaster. Gaster. Gastro means stomach. Stomach. And word root is gaster. So gaster algae. Gaster algae. Gaster, gaster, algae, gastro, dynia. We have joined two words with stomach, gaster. One is algae, one is dynia. But algae is starting with a vowel itself. A is a vowel. So we just join them. When the suffix is starting with the vowel itself, here in this case A, we just join them. No need to add another vowel. But when suffix, which is dynia, is starting with a consonant, then do add a vowel here. So we said this is gastrodynia. Gastro dynia because if we do not add here the word will be gastrodynia gastrodynia is not a smooth pronunciation there is no meaning there is no meaning special meaning of applying vowel in any term the only meaning of applying vowel and having so many vowel for one meaning is to make the pronunciation smooth if i say gastrodynia it will it is not smooth when i say gastrodynia so it is a smooth pronunciation that's why i applied it over here so the two suffixes is the algia pain gastralgia gastralgia and the other is gastrodynia both have the same meaning pain both have the same meaning Next, I am going to apply, write a suffix which means disease. Stenosis. Stenosis is a suffix which means narrowing. Stenosis is a suffix which means narrowing. Stenosis narrowing. The word for for example is arteriostenosis. Arteriostenosis. It means arterio. Artery, she knows artery has become narrow. Artery has become narrow. Arteriostenosis. There is another word, athero. One is an F, I think. Arteriostenosis. It means narrowing of the artery.
नेक्स्ट वर्ड इज मगैली मेगैली मीन एनलार्जमेंट नेक्स्ट सफिक्स इज मगैली एंड मेगैली मीन एनलार्जमेंट वी कैन यूज दिस वर्ड लाइक कार्डियो मगैली एनलार्जमेंट ऑफ दी हार्ट एनलार्जमेंट ऑफ दी हार्ट There's so many रीजन for cardiomegaly, hypertension, cardiomyopathies, valvular disease. There could be many. So cardiomegaly mean enlarged heart. Cardi is heart. Megaly mean enlarged. The other place we can use megaly is hepatomegaly. He pato ही पैट ओ मगैली ही पैट इज लिवर मगैली इज एनलार्जमेंट ओ इज बावल ही पैटो मगैली सो दिस इज एन लार्ज लिवर समाइम लिवर इज एन लार्ज लाइक सरोसिस सॉरी इनिशियल स्टेजिज ऑफ सरोसिस हेपाटाइटिस If there is tumor inside, if there is cancer in the liver, liver will enlarge. Even in cardiac congestive cardiac failure, the liver will enlarge. So this is known as hepatomegaly. Liver is enlarge. Normally, if you feel try to feel the liver below the uh, below the ribs, it is not palpable. But if it become palpable, it means the liver is enlarged. So hepatomegaly, enlargement of the liver, hepatomegaly. Next is splenomegaly. Spleen means spleen. Megaly mean enlargement. So spleno megaly is enlargement of the spleen. It happens in chronic uh, chronic malaria. Chronic malaria, the liver is enlarged to such a size that it can go up to the right iliac fossa. Spleno megaly, enlargement of the spleen. Hepato megaly. Enlargement of the liver, cardiomegaly. Enlargement of the heart. Next word is stenosis. Oh, sorry. Next word is sclerosis. Is mean hardening. Something has hard become hard abnormally due to some diseases. Secular uh, mean hardening. Osis mean abnormal condition. Any abnormal condition. It means abnormal condition of hardening. What has become hard? Bone has become hard. Osteo, osteo, sclerosis. Sclerosis is hardening. Osti is bone. Osti is bone. O is bowel. Osti is bone. Sclerosis, sclerosis is hardening. So osteo sclerosis. is hardening of the bone next word is arthro arthro sclerosis 
Arthur is joint and uh, Arthur is joint and sclerosis is hardening. Artho sclerosis. Artho is Arthur is joint sclerosis is hardening. 